To perform a nasotracheal intubation, direct your partner to ventilate the patient while you gather your equipment and supplies needed for intubation. Once you have all your supplies ready, instruct your partner to stop ventilating the patient. Lubricate the tube with water-soluble jelly. With the bevel of the tube facing the nasal septum, insert the tube and advance it along the nasal floor. Position yourself behind the patient with one hand on the tube. Use your thumb and index finger of your other hand to palpate the larynx. The curve of the tube should follow the natural curve of the airway. If resistance is met, remove the tube and try the patient's other nostril. If the tube still won't advance, try a tube that is one half millimeter smaller. Continue to advance the tube, rotating it medially 15 to 30 degrees until maximum airflow is heard through the tube. Insert the tube gently and quickly during the patient's inspiration. Look for condensation to appear in the tube as it approaches the trachea. Once the tube is in place, inflate the cuff with 5 to 10 cc's of air and remove the syringe. Commence ventilations with the bag valve mask attached to high-flow oxygen. Check for proper tube placement by auscultating the chest, listening for equal breath sounds on each side and no breath sounds over the epigastrium. Next, confirm tube placement with a secondary method, such as an end-tidal CO2 detector or a bulb or syringe device. Finally, secure the tube with a commercial restraint device.